For a decade, volunteers like this have been donning gowns and lying down in medical scanners up and down the UK. But Steve here is special, the 100,000th participant in something called UK Biobank to have nearly every part of his body scanned, completing a project to build the world's most comprehensive medical image database. This is a huge milestone for UK Biobank because when we started the project 11 years ago, no one thought this was feasible. What this imaging data will enable researchers to be able to do is just to answer questions like, why is it that someone in their early 60s has the heart function or the brain function of someone 10 years older? What are the genetic and lifestyle factors that influence accelerated ageing and the development of of disease. So right now Steve is spending 30 minutes lying stock still in this MRI scanner having his whole body imaged and after that it's straight on to another MRI for another 30 minutes having his brain scanned in intimate detail. Add together all the other tests and procedures that go on it's a four to five hour commitment of his time. It makes you wonder why he and a hundred thousand other people have volunteered to do it. I've had family We've had health issues, my mum in particular at the moment now, she's suffering from early stages of dementia. Close friends have had cancer and things. Giving up my time for medical research, who can learn from people, the lifestyles, the health, and obviously what their bodies are like, which ultimately, at the end of the day, is going to help med medical research for the future. Scans of the brains, hearts, abdomens, as well as ultrasound images and x-rays from 100,000 volunteers are all anonymised. And their real power comes from being linked to the medical and lifestyle data of each de-identified participant, along with biological samples like this tube of Steve's blood. That will be added to this frozen library of lives, 10 million tiny tubes of samples from the 500,000 participants in the wider Biobank project. Every day, a sub-zero robot serves requests for data from more than 20,000 researchers around the world, many of whom are now using AI to make the most of the 30,000 petabytes now available to them. We predicted it would take us thousands of years of manual analysis. Now we can analyse everything in seconds. It's quite extraordinary. We can now look at every organ and tissue in the body, and that is... Um, helped us understand uh, things like you know, aneurysm risks, you know, how muscle fat is related to frailty, and how liver fat is prevalent in 25% like, of the UK population. So we've been able to understand a lot about all sorts of disease mechanisms just from the biobank data. And soon there'll be more. The next step already underway is to rescan 60,000 of these volunteers over time to reveal even more about how our bodies change as we age. Tom Clark, Sky News, Reading.